cakes up. Just kidding. of making the cutest collection ever for my clothing brand bad closet in part one we made or we started on some long sleeves a cardigan not done um flare pants also not done and a capri with a matching top welcome back if you watched the first episode if you're new i can link it if you'd like to watch it um yeah let's get into it okay so i want to give y'all like the vibe that i'm going for for this collection i started off like last week with all a lot of the more basic pieces because i feel like basic pieces are so essential and they're so hard to find good ones so the vibe that i'm going for is very sexy i'm feeling like long sleeves i'm feeling low backs <laughs> i'm feeling like bows and brooches like like here like to gather the fabric and then like what else am i feeling low in the front high in the front i'm feeling maybe lace so yeah there's a lot of different like all the brandies in my brain are like running around with all these different ideas so again i do have sketches but like if you saw my first video then you understand that they're not good but like this is what works for me so I'll, I'll show you guys anyways whatever also this is cinnamon so don't be scared i'm gonna get started first on my off the shoulder moment but my issue is how do i make it off the shoulder but also backwards so what I like to do is make like a really just rough dress put it together so I have something to work with and then refine from there I still need to do whatever I want to do with the sleeves but I'm kind of just focusing on the fit right now which I clearly need to fix I want it to be like an open back like that kind of I like had to tie it because it's too big the sleeves obviously I need to fix maybe make it a little less like a little tighter you know so that they can stand on their own you know but i like i kind of like the way this falls as well yeah but not bad right like and then for the back here i kind of like the idea of having like a little gather but i still want to do a bow or, or something yeah, this dress is literally falling off of me <laughs> it's it's a no it's a no it's a it's a not yet okay it's a work in progress but we're gonna get there so i sort of figured it out i sort of figured it out this is probably my like what 10th attempt <laughs> there's one more thing i have to fix um but yeah i just wanted to give you an update we are making a brand new design today let's see how this goes i'm using my ugo fabric it's like it feels like a swimsuit like i don't even know why the heck i bought it but now i'm happy that i did because i can use them to make samples and not feel bad that i'm wasting anything because like, do you hear how ugly that sounds? I already have, like, patterns that I can sort of use to make this dress, which, thank, thank God, because make, like, trying to make the pattern is 100% the longest part for me. Okay, let's see for real how many times, I'm gonna count 
how many t tries is it gonna take me like i wish it could just be like cut and i'm done but that's just not how it works and i need to be okay with the fact that things take time like making things takes time and that's okay but it's also like ugh, like hurry up you know like i just wish i could finish things so fast like you know those girls that have or boys that have like four jobs a kid they go to art class they have two businesses and and a side job like how do you do that how do you do it because it'll take me three four five days to make one dress you know and i know like i know it's okay like i know things take time but shit like does it have to take that long all the time oh my god anyways i'm going to be okay i'm going to embrace the process of making this dress because at the end of the day i want it to be beautiful and perfect and if that means it's gonna take me a few extra days or whatever then that's what it means and that's okay this is round one uno runo um i'm gonna add sleeves for sure i don't know if i want this neckline to be lower because this just kind of looks like this is like the entrance to a portal or something i think if it was like this it would be better like a longer I mean a lower neckline and a bigger hole. <laughs> My sewing room is just, it's just yikes. It's just yikes on yikes on, it's just yikes Diana up in here. I just cannot, I don't even want to sh show you. It is so outrageous. Anyways, I am making my second top with new fabric because I ran out of the ugly white fabric. This is the back. This is the front. Okay, so I just base stitched the back and the front together at the shoulder. And now I'm going to attach the sleeve. I like attaching the corners first and the middle and then the inside, I guess. All right, this is what the inside of it looks like. These are the sleeves, the front and back. I'm gonna flip her over like this or something and then sew this all down. This top is not seeing the light of day. This is for research purposes only. So yeah, it's gonna be like that. And now I'm sewing down the sleeve and the top. <laughs> I think it'll be cute. Do you guys think this will be the one? In my dreams, I made it into a top instead of a dress just to save some fabric. But now that I'm looking at the top, I feel like it could be cute like a top and skirt situation. Any who's, neckline is too low, hole is too big now, which is hilarious because I had the opposite problem two seconds ago. I think what I need to do is make this with the real fabric, but I'm scared, I'm scared. I don't wanna waste anything. Maybe a small hole would be cute, cuter. You know, like a small little guy. Yeah, I think that would be way cuter. But I still want to add the string. Girls on this and all they do is just twerk some, twerk some. Kind of like that. Which is literally my first, the first one. <laughs> Oh my god. 
like I really do like sewing but I feel like it's like sewing like having a business is like having a child you know like you love your child you would you would do anything for your child you will you will spend every waking moment thinking about your child but sometimes do you want to just like beat your child up probably let's be real like sometimes do you just want to like sewing sometimes is so annoying <laughs> that's okay because i love it you know i am feeling this size hole right now when i start doing this that means i'm feeling it okay so i wasn't planning on recording today but i really want to show you what <laughs> i just did i'm i'm literally this is the the state of my area I was I'm binding the like little circle cutouts that I'm making. Shout out to the older Australian lady on YouTube that showed me how. It was a great tutorial. But like just look at the shirt, okay? Look. <laughs> I did such a horrible like this is just like a big this is just like a big gaping hole. Like what? what is my problem oh my gosh like that is do people's normally look like that Ugh, ew i mean maybe if i iron it down it'll look cuter anyways i just thought that was funny you definitely cannot see me it is friday november something something and i am officially clocking out i am done so, I don't know how even long it's been. I think maybe two weeks and I've been trying to make two dresses and these are all of, these are all of the attempts that I went through. This is ridiculous. Okay, look. Oh my God. One, two, three, eight, 12, 13 and there's probably more around my house that I cannot find Just 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 I hate sewing just kidding pretty much Just trying to perfect those two dress designs. I'm like Almost there almost there. I think my backless dress is good and my holy cutout dress is almost there but i'm just clock my i'm done okay i'm clocking out and i'm gonna start on my new designs next week but let me show you where we're at okay lots it's not done obviously i need to make this hole again i need to change the shape of it i wanted to do two but i'm kind of liking just one and this is a skirt so you know maybe you can wear it like this or like this and then I have I wanted to add like a string here so you could do a little bow I clearly have to change the bow but yeah this is just the idea of it and this is definitely the fabric I'm gonna use for it for sure okay so this is the next set dress in the sample fabric the one that I wanted to be off the shoulder and backless all I really had to do was add elastic to keep this up. Like that was that was the big solution. And here is the back. Yeah, I really like this one. So now I just need to make this into real fabric and see how it looks. But like not bad. I think it's pretty cute. I, I like the low back. I like this one. It's pretty cute. Are you responsible? 